Limited Viper shall continue his journey and we see 1603 yellow, 18 wins, zero losses. I have a feeling today will be the last day Limited Viper stays undefeated. Today shall be a difficult journey to try and get 1700 or at least the first steps there. But I am expecting to lose today. Who wins member Limited Viper? Oof, maybe that's a show match we have to pursue after you only plans to change the limit if you get a loss? No. Let's queue. Don't snipe me. I know you're trying. I know you're thinking about it. Don't snipe me. Oh boy. Oh boy. Arena. Actually, oof. I had some issues with Arena so far. Arabia is still the worst. So Arena, I feel I give myself a better chance than Arena. All right. Let's do it. Limited Viper in action. Let's see. Ma mag yours. I got mag yours. All right. So far, so good. Honestly, Magor is not that bad of a save. Our weakness in this case would be the fact that he has Siege Honor, Halberdiers. Oh, I forgot to finish the house. Okay, this is fine. Oh boy. I do I even bother the leading walls? Is it worth it? Can't resist. Uh, his elo is 1635, so he's slightly higher elo than us. So he's clearly the favorite going into this. So, Magyars aren't that bad, because you have a pretty good setup to fight for for relics. But late game, where he would have access to Siege Onager, Halberdiers, a bunch of dungeons, then it could become a bit more tricky. Especially since Magyars late game kind of relies on like a lot of speed, raid, micro. That's not my strength as Limited Viper. Magus was even kind of meta. If you guys were, some of you would remember, NAC had a arena map called Hippo Arena, and in that version there was a little bit more space in the middle, so Magus was even a pick on arena. To um, play like light cav to keep map control, and then since it was a fairly longer and more open map, there was um, the room to micro and use the mobility. Yeah, we gotta save our actions now, because we're bringing in a boar. This feels chill. I just spent most of my, my, my actions. Oh, this is risky. Oh! I'm not doing that again. No chance. No chance. That, I'm not doing that again. Yeah, we can't go mega efficiency. Normally I would not kill the deer until the boar is eaten. But... I have a bit of a limited action handicap, so I have to be a little bit less perfectionist. This, that's a word. Okay, that should be fine. We'll wait for the next year until we have brought the boar back. Oh, I only had two clicks there. That was important. Let's just do this. I was considering gar garrisoning again, but. Not better of it. Is there a purpose to this limitation outside of entertainment? First of all, the purpose is to showcase you can actually get quite high simply by doing the right things at the right time without being super valid. Like, one of the big advantages top players have in many cases is that they are faster. All right, they have more speed, they have more multitasking, they're able to just macro more, micro more, all the good stuff, right? Which is a very important part of being good at the game. But the purpose is, first of all, to see the curiosity to see how far can I go with a limited set of actions. Secondly, it's to get the feeling of how it is to be doubt. And thirdly, it is to showcase that you can get pretty far with just a, a good set of decisions, doing the right thing at the right time. I mean, I'm in implying here that I'm doing the right thing at the right time and making good decisions. But that's the point. For those who have, don't know, uh, all of you can try this. This is a program made by Mamars and it's open source. Every one of you can try it. You can also change the limit you see here. The limit can be 10, 20, 40, 60, 100 and the bank cap can go up to 100 as well. You guys can all download this and try it out yourself if you want to, if you have interest in that. Oh, I should probably do a mill. Um, might be going up too fast here. I don't have a second building. Oh god. 
Oh, it's fine, it's fine. Happens. It's also a painful experience. Uh, can you share some of the initial doubt roasting since the quarterfinal? We didn't roast much. We like okay. Um, what happened was like we were on voice right with an admin. So as soon as the games were done, we just jumped off, or like we didn't jump off, but we we talked a little bit, right? So I was essentially asking him what the hell was that strategy last game and things like that. Besides that, not really a lot of roasting. You don't really want to go too ham right after a person has lost. There's a limit there as well, or a balance you want to strike. You don't want to risk stepping on someone's toes. If he was like real disappointed with the set, I didn't want to upset him, for example, right? But he seemed fine, so it was a little bit of banter. Do they even have enough food to click up here? I don't think so. Yeah, I think this build will not be pretty. Tell to do a little bit of a delayed um, cast ledge. So we probably have to make like three bills. I should have built up an action bank before this. Okay. With three villagers. Let's just try to force drop all the food. Okay, worked out. It worked out. I'm not really building scouts, I'm not fighting for relics here. That's also hard with limited actions. We might do like 3 TC and then add a stable afterwards if we see him going for relics. Oh, I have more attack. So unless he's building extra scouts, I will always win that fight. We have to make sure we don't take any... We don't run out of action banks. A action bank. When I could run into enemy army. Oh, well, so far looking good. He's not really fighting back there. What maps are hard to play right now for Limited Viper? I think open maps, where you kind of depend on walling and, mi and actively microing in the opening. So probably like maps like Arabia, Haboob. I'm not sure what the map pool looks like right now. But those types of maps. So far this game has been fairly chill though. He's castledge now, but there's no indicator of him doing anything to fight for relics. Like I don't see extra scouts, I don't see a spearman, I don't see him coming for a castle drop. So right now it's looking... Oh! Looking... Oh. I may have jinxed that one. It is what it is. One of the hardest things as well with Limited Viper is to add um, farms. Each farm is like select the villager to add farm and then like build and then farm so it's like three clicks at least every time you want to build a single farm could obviously take but take one and hold shift and spam farms but that's like it still i need to have a lot of wood in the bank to do that but the new wall you wouldn't with houses is just natural build up if there's any aggression coming i have a little bit of a semi wall on the left side still see a relics on the field but i mean i see four of them there is a chance he has picked one up but let's hope not. If I see one relic disappear, I'm gonna build a barracks immediately. Actually, we have like 16 farms already, I think. I think I'll do it. Oh wait, one relic disappeared. Okay, time has come. To get maybe a scout or two on the field. Hmm. It's a bit hard because I need to afford everything. I need to keep the macro going. But I also need to add a stable. We have extra attacks, so we can fight there. He has monks on the field, so he can easily convert. So I need to have clicks available for when his monks come as well. Uh. Need houses. Oh, there's only one relic left. Which means he has at least two monks on the field. Now I feel the limitations. This is probably a mistake. Maybe I should have gone full boom. And just hope for the best. I just wasted clicks. 
Itt úgy kezdődik. Szolgálatára. I see something green on the map. I don't know what it is. Okay, it was a monk. I don't have clicks anyway to deal with it. Okay. I want to see, maybe there is another relic on the field somewhere. We can maybe fight for that one. God, this is now getting to the frustration point where I cannot. I would have so many things I need to do, and I cannot do them. Maybe playing boom game is also a mistake by me. What's here? Ooh. So many monks. Don't have clicks anyway to deal with that. Could still be a relic here, for example. Oh, so Where is this monk? I've been housed so long. I don't have clicks. Okay. Fight that. Guess I'm maybe doing some sort of fast imp kind of follow up. And if I come away with this with two relics, I'm still kind of fine with that. Okay. I'm floating so much wood. Not even funny. How is Viper Limited? Every single way. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna spend all my next clicks on this. We have 25 farms. I would like to get up to a solid 40 at least. Okay. So he's got four relics. No bueno. Yeah, I'm limited everywhere except my mind. My mind also feels a bit limited, to be fair. Okay. Yeah, we'll get one relic. Just took the score lead. I'm not sure if that's because he clicked Imperial Age or anything else. Are team games limited as well? I haven't played it with team game, no. I don't think team game limited Viper would be fun, personally. Okay. Yeah, we should go up next. Get a castle somewhere and think about our composition. Have to go Cavachers. It seems so intense for you. Really? What town center is? Let's just do imp right away. I mean, light cavern not bad to have in the field anyway. What? Oh, true, I changed my hot case. His monastery is exposed. That's a potential mistake for him to build it so close to the to the wall. We can try to drop a castle there. And then he maybe steal those. I have a feeling he's on the way to imp himself. So the imp timing might not be great for us. This is going to put us on like 49 farmers. I think that's going to be the last farm I make for a while. Now we have to put more on wood. And take it from there. Yeah, we are trying to push the relics. You think playing with limited APM made you better? No. Yeah, he's in faster. Which means he probably has a castle up already. I'm not sure how my cow would perform against... Um, against sergeants. You should see this now. We're also gonna need houses. I'll spend some clicks now, just getting houses up. If I only had wood. 
Oh, he has a Castilla there. I don't have a great way to win this trap fight. I think my plan will have to be... Let's get the unique upgrades. And prepare and like conscription. And open the wall so we can run in. We'll make another stable. Uh, click. So we're expecting this castle to go down. We just want to get some upgrades that we require. Limited Viper makes you scared to queue up in case you get embarrassed on stream. <laughs> Is it embarrassing to lose the Limited Viper? Do you feel like that? Okay, we are preparing couches, which as well, we have to. Oh, is it open? No, it's not open. Uh, conscription will finish, that's fine. We only have 94 wills, so we should queue up. That should be fine. <laughs> I did not. I'm not in time to get the unique techno. It will come later. He's still stuck in his base, though. So despite him having relics, he doesn't have. Um, he hasn't. Does not have map control. I'll put one monk on each side. For some map control. Ooh, Castilla there. He has helps. We need couches faster. We'll send those spirits to try and bait him, and we'll try to send the light cave to attack. Never mind. The helps are there. This looks bad, guys. This looks very bad. We need a castle. What is the box on top left? It's the, the clicks I can make. How many actions I can click. Need more houses. Adding siege as well now, so he's going for the composition that will be hard for us to deal with. AKA... Halb SO, probably. Try to get the market AS ASAP. Put the light cap to the side to see if we can raid some at some point. 600 wood will build that quite fast. Can sell out micro? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just forcing the issue. It's the right play by him. I don't have, like, I need so many clicks to pull this off. I need so much time to pull this off. My switch. So him just forcing the issue is the absolute right move. But he might be wasting some helps. I need clicks! Luckily he's only hitting, he's not hitting my castle yet. Yeah, this is looking rough. Has Limited Viper lost before? Nope, this is looking very much like the first loss. And I feel like there's not much I can do about it. Okay, this is open now, that's fine. Even as fetching. Like a pro. That's uh, the Sicilian thing. I mean, I can reach his traps, though, if he, if he goes to my castle. They sure are those onagers. Let me click! Yep. 
think he missed micro a little bit there. I'm just gonna build up some clips. I have some stuff I need to do here. Is that elite? No, not elite. Cavalier as well with extra armor. Um, I need to find a way to get those traps. I don't have a way to get them right now. I also wonder if it's worth it for me to repair this. Population still seems relatively fine. The stone says no. Yep. Yeah, I think I just won't have units to deal with this. Don't think I can snipe those traps. My cast still will go down, that's for sure. Yeah, this is one this is a game where I just feel checkmated. I feel like there's nothing I can do about this. So in hindsight, I think boom games is maybe bad for me. With limited viper. Just need so many clicks at this stage. To get things going. I think I can maybe still try to just build like up to 80 cow watchers maybe and hope that he can never take a good fight. Chili, Sam, thank you for the four months. How much armor do these have? Eight? The cow watchers still, still, do, still do somewhat okay. I'm wasting a lot of clicks because I changed my health keys for Limited Viper a little bit. And I'm using my other health keys. Which is bad. Yeah, I think we're dead. It was doomed to happen. I felt it last game. Spam Hussars? I, don't, I just don't have clicks. Even if I do that, I don't have clicks to micro them or anything. So it's over anyway. The first loss of offic uh, official Viper. Of limited viper is a fact. Yeah, as soon as we have ran into an opponent on arena that he has five TC, that knows how to boom a little bit, picks up the relics. I actually think Magras might even be better in Imperial Age, but because there is still a lot of mobility usage on the map. Sixteen hundred is the cap. It might be. But I think also I, I think I cannot go into a, a macro game. I need to make strategical, tricky plays. Otherwise, this type of styles I cannot deal with. I just don't have the, the actions for it. I mean, we're not going to change the settings now. We're going to still play a little bit more to see if we can climb back to 1600 and then onwards. But once we are like, okay, we just cannot break a certain elo. That's where it stops. Yeah, he's ahead in eco as well. I need to, if I get arena games, I need to make the games tricky. I cannot play like the, a regular macro game. I think it was a mistake by me as well to try and fight for the relics. Because that also slowed down my boom a lot. 